Hey lovelies, welcome to my shiny collection or welcome back to it. It's been a couple of months and I sort of decided to give you an update on my shiny collection. Just showcasing what I've got in my storage anyway. So let's get started. Last time we ended with the patrat, so let's just show you what else we've got in the meantime. Got another shiny Murkrow. That one is up for trade, if anyone would like that. Then a shiny Oddish, which was it, and another Safari Zone event. I'm very happy I got one because I was really afraid I wouldn't get any. So it's like this cutie baby one. So it's this cutie one. Then a shiny Natu. I didn't have that one before and I was super excited because I finally got it. Like. As soon as I got released, I was clicking every single Natu I could find. And yeah, I'm just so excited. I finally got one after, I would say, two years since it was released. Shiny Mewtwo. Mmm, absolutely adore it. It's uh, the Side Strike one, and he is also my best buddy. So if I ever decide to like take him out for another walk, he has a CP boost, so that's absolutely amazing. This was the Trap Inch Community Day. I wasn't very lucky during the Community Day, so in the end I only got three. I traded for most of them and I was just happy that other people got them. So I could finally get that beauty. I absolutely adore it. Halloween event. Shiny Sableye! Oh, it's so adorable. I really love gold-like shinies and the pink purple ones. Those are absolutely my favorite. Miss Travis also during that same event and Shiny Mask. I was on the middle of a spinner quest and I was really really close of getting them all and I was four out of five great Curveball throws and then I encountered this and I was like Shall I try it? Shall I try it? But then I just went full fuck it and all that matter was catching this one because it was so rare and I'm really glad I got it. Then I got another shiny Patrat. I want to evolve it and I will evolve a couple of shinies I have double. So let's keep that for the end of the video. Shiny Weave Oil and another Shiny Sneasel. So in the end I had three Shiny Sneasels. The one I called on my birthday, which I'm not gonna evolve because that's like a really fond memory. And then these two. I'm really happy I got that. This one's called Finn because for some reason I always get Shinies when Finn is driving. So if he's driving I just sit next to him in the car and I just click on any Pokemon that could be potentially shiny and yeah, it usually it's just in the car that I get the shinies. It's either on the toilet or in the car, but those are the best shinies. Chimchar Community Day, got a video up on YouTube about that. Got a look at those. Like a 96% that's absolutely amazing. I love that. Then we have shiny tentacle. Also, went to the grocery store, sat in the car, clicked it, shiny. Like I'm usually internally screaming if I just get a shiny I didn't have yet. I'm like, oh, yes, finally. I may scare people with that and I'm so sorry for that, but I just love it when there's a shiny in there. No shiny Caterpie. I think it's my fourth one and I already gave one away. Reggie Steel. So the Reggie Steel or the Reggie communi community raid type of thing, there wasn't really a success. But thankfully one of the people I raid with, like our core group, she got like three shiny Reggie Steels and one shiny Reggie Eyes. So um, we became lucky friends and I absolutely love the new lucky friends thing that you have a guaranteed 
lucky trade so always when you just trade it will become a better not always but usually it will become a better one and that's 93 percent is absolutely amazing yeah and on shiny mining i trashed three of them after the previous video burmy very lucky to get it go plus it shiny slacker got that one during the december community day not too happy with that Gonna Shiny Gligar, got it reserved for Natasha if she wants it, it's all yours. Shiny Snover, oh, it's an absolutely beauty. I love that it's arms and like the back, it's blue, oh, such a beauty. Sandtrend, you can guess where I got it. Same old place. And red eyes. I do like the darker color, but it's not that much of an interesting one. Okay, Shiny Gibble. Shiny Gibble had been out for quite some time and there aren't a whole lot of Gibble spawns. I think people were like, maybe it's gonna be a community day thing or whatever. So I did know Gibble was or is very rare. And if there was a spawn in town, people would just put it up straight away like, oh, there's a gibble spawn, run, run, run. But usually I would have either grabbed a car and like put everything in the right position and I would never be able to make all those spawns. So I pretty much ignored my gibble, like every time it spawned. And then when I was hatching a couple of eggs, I was just sitting at home and I was done with doing my thing. So I booted up the game and then the eggs started hatching and this was actually my first gibble and it's so adorable i just love it so much it's so cute i don't want to evolve it because it's so cute though electronic beautiful home spawn when i'm at home there are about three spawns so this one was beautifully spawned at home, coughing, got it while walking to the gym. Or was that the other one? I have two shiny coughings, like one I got after a raid night in a car with my friend. <laughs> Thank you so much for like driving me around during raid hour. And the other one I got while walking to the gym. Shane Shelder. Lovely catch at work. People always look a bit strange like me if I'm like, yay! I do like the Piplup. It's like nice and icy blue. I haven't evolved it to the last one yet because I was hoping for a better shiny. Heatran. Another raid hour. We don't raid a whole lot anymore except for those like weekly raid hour things if we have time so on top sometimes we just raid sometimes we just do a couple of raids but not always and usually if there's a shiny we do raids more often but only on those wednesdays and i was very happy when i finally got a one request a lucky trade special request from the boyfriend I asked Finn specifically if I could have his shiny Rayquaza because, um, well, on my birthday when I caught the Sneasel I wasn't lucky enough to get a Rayquaza and he got one so I asked him if I could please 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 have that one and since he's not playing a whole lot anymore he just raids sometimes he gave it to me and I'm so happy with it oh here, here's the coughing I was talking about that's the second one Shiny Agron, also from Finn. Like, I caught the shiny Aaron for him. He evolved it. And um, I asked it back, like, I caught it for you, can I please have it? Okay, this one. Also got it from Finn. He got it with his breakthrough and that was just crazy. I never expected 
him to get like a shiny flower crown Eevee and I was so excited when he got it. I kind of feel like a thief though. I kind of feel like I'm going to steal all your shinies because uh, <laughs> but it's just such a beauty. Wormpole, not with a party hat though. Just imagine the party hat. Yeah, beautiful purple. I love that. Purple, purple. The six x soon, number two. And this was uh, during the community thing like two weeks ago. Look what a cute. I just love it when they're pink and they're all cute. And this was the best one I actually caught because I did like a bunch of quests and this was the best one. So I would like to evolve that one in a bit. Shiny Groundon, got it from a friend. Also lucky. Bronzer, with the Hatch event of last weekend. It was the Shiny Riolu and I got this one. Bit of a disappointment. That's my second one. So getting full of it. Um, as last but not least, Lickitung. Today, Lickitung read. Day, like three hours of reading. Good. Two of them. So, of course, we have to evolve one of them. So, let's get into evolving. The first one I'm going to evolve is the Shelter. Let's go. Just so excited. I don't know why I get so excited about this, but it's just so beautiful to have something getting evolved after you've been saving it for a very long time. Oh my god. Oh, I love it. And the next one. The Petrat. Beautiful blue eyes. I love mm. it. I keep saying I love it. I'm so sorry about that. It's just... Everything is so cute, you know? Oh my god! It looks like he's wearing a green sweater! Mm. Wow. Let's also evolve this zigzag. I thought when the evolution... When it was... I thought when it was getting evolved, he would turn into a pink one. Please. Be pink. I completely forgot about it. No. Huh? What was supposed to be? There was one thing going to be pink. No, not new charge attack. Pokedex entry. Shiny. I used you. I have no idea what's happening. My phone got stuck. Hello? Oh. Due to an unknown error. I broke it. Let's try again. Alright, the game booted up again. So let's do the two last evolutions. This Pronsor. <laughs> that eye just peeking out of it. Come on, little baby, you can do this. I'm gonna be so proud of you. Ta -da! Ta -ta -da -da! I hope I can use them in PvP, that would be cool. Look at those little arms. Whee! And then Licky Tongue. It's gonna be an amazing Licky Licky. It's like bouncing up and down, bouncing up and down. Come on. You can do this. Looks a bit like a balloon with a Wi Fi thing on the tummy. Looks so cool. Shadow ball. Completely forgot about a coughing. 64% IV. Let's go. Let's get the purple smoke and turn it in something else. Here you go. 
Boom. Oh, I love the teal purple. New makeup look, maybe? Who knows? All right, and now let's get into my 100% Pokemon. So first of all, I don't have a whole lot of 100%ers. It's mainly because I often just click away the Pokemon. I don't catch every single one of them. So most of them are just hatched or accidentally caught. I accidentally found out that this Miss Drevis or Miss Megas was 100%. And Oma Star. This was the first one I power upped completely. For it, I'm not sure what to do with it, but I just kept it because it's 100%. Articuno, that was a really nice one. It was Articuno Ray Day, and I did not get a shiny on that Ray Day, unfortunately, but I did get. This one, we were out for sandwich after the raiding. We did about 13 raids, which was quite a lot because we were with a really big group. So we were eating a sandwich and then I was just checking all the fees of the Articunos I called and this one was 100% there. Another Duck Trio. But with fabulous hair though. Metagross hatched it. That was amazing. I never expected I could hatch something. It was at the end of the community day, we were finished. I didn't really get like a whole lot of shiny beldams. So getting this was a really nice surprise. An Eevee, hatched it as well. I don't really know what to do with this Eevee. Should it just keep it the way it is or should I evolve it? Let me know in the comments down below. 100%. Kitty Cat. I always name my best called Kitty Cat like Pokemon Romain because that's my cat and I just feel like I have a little cute kitty cat in a game just like in real life. Yeah. yeah. Iggy Buff. I do like the 100% babies and I just never know if I should evolve them. This one, lucky. What happened was I didn't have time to raid. I'm not sure how long Verizon was here, but I asked one of my friends if he had like one left over because we were lucky friends anyway, and he had one. This is actually my first lucky hundo, and that's really cool. I want to power it up all the way. Looks a bit silly, but also very cute. Pichu, of course, hatched. Cute little head. I think I'm just gonna keep the babies. And then I hatched a 100% elegant. Which I evolved though. Hmm. Should I do the rest too? Except the Pichu. And also the Fungus. I'm gonna use that for PvP because it's 100% IV and like good CP. And that was the last one of my hondo collection. So yeah lovelies, that concludes the little update of my collection in Pokemon Go. Out of all these shinies, I would honestly say that the Flower Crown Eevee is absolutely my favorite because it's so damn rare. And it's so freaking adorable. And we need more cuteness in the world, right? So. Thank you all for watching and let me know what your favorite shiny Pokemon is and uh, what I should do with 100% Eevee. So thank you all for watching and have a great day.